guys and welcome. My name is Jack Madness and welcome back to Undertale. Let's put my sound a little down for now. There we go. And yeah, it's been a while since I played it, so I thought let's continue where we left off. <laughs> the <laughs> Dark thinks it's the artist. Oh, one of those again. Let's see. Yeah. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Well, it's been a while since I played Undertale, but I'm actually quite glad I started it again. It's been a while since I played it, and yeah. It seems quite fun to do it again. Put the chicken on my head. Oh, hey, Sans. <coughs> What's up? Uh, what are you guys? What? <coughs> Say, are you following me? No, I think you are following me, my man. Give me a Let's decorate. <laughs> you had to think of the edge of the No, that would be great stuff. Can we... Um... Get that. Okay, let's my gift to the second one. Let's just... Anything to heal us? We have a snowman. Nice cream. Hey, uh, wait, wait, what? It's okay. Let's see what I can find here. It's a door. Maybe if I turn these off. I have never seen this again before, actually. No. Well done. That's new. I've never seen that before. I must admit it myself. Quite nice to find. I'll try to see if next episode I can find out how to enter there because it looks pretty interesting if you say so myself. Now yeah, let's just go. It's a snow bluff. I think somewhere around here will be a bigger dog. Oh, here it is. Hello, dog girl. <laughs> oh, damn. We have Biff dog girl here. Um, let's have a look at We just want to fix it. Well, let's play it. Oh, no. Play the playful dog girl. Play the dog girl. Hmm. The greater dog is putting the ground with his front paws. How about we play? <laughs> it's plants on the ground. The greater dog will fix up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. The dog is very tired and for this head on you. Oh, cute doggy. Want some TLC? Uh, that one? Okay, well, apparently it's not back in. Oh, bark, 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 bark. TLC. Um. You're moving slow, but you still haven't put enough. Damn it. 
that more. You cut decisively. Bad capitation resists 100%. So the dark swaps over with his legs hanging in the air. This one tunnels. Ah, there we go. Spare. You won! You earn 0 XP. Oh, 40 XP. Oh, doggy. Doggo. <laughs> <laughs> it goes. <laughs> there it goes. <laughs> Sniffing its own butt, apparently. <laughs> I love Undertale, to be fairly honest. Uh, I love how it's made. And oh, hey, son. Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlet of deadly terror. When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, sparks will swing, blades will slice. Each part will be swing finally up and down. Only the tiniest chance of fixing me will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it! Yeah, okay, let's go. Well, what's the order? Hold up! What hold up? I'm, I'm about to activate it now. You got to work, didn't you? Yes, you did! Please, kill That uh, doesn't look very active. Well, this challenge, it seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah! We can't use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair. And my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes! Whew! <laughs> what are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus! Yeah! Huh? <laughs> <laughs> brother is going to do. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Well, I know blue attacks, so it's gonna be nice. Ay, ay, ay. Welcome to Snowden. Alright, well, let's get going then. To Snowden. Snowden. <laughs> oh, hey, there we go. What can I buy? Tough cloth, manly banana, a bicycle. <laughs> it's my own recipe. Nice, nice, but no thanks. Goodbye. The sight of such friendly town fills you with determination. Safe. Let's see what is here in the inn. Welcome to the Snowden Inn. Uh, Snowden's premier hotel. Give me one moment. Is it? No, I'm not gonna stay. There we go. I am sorry. Well, feel free to come back anytime. <laughs> that was something important, guys. I'm sorry for that. Don't want to walk the other side of the time. Try the under snow tunnels. They're effectively laid out. Overflowing with Unread Jung Mill. Yeah, well, I know there's an overflowing mill. That look in your eye. You're someone that has trouble doing crosswords, aren't you? <laughs> Welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. I love working on a newspaper. There's so little to report if we just fill it in with comics and games. <laughs> When I was younger, my teacher gave me word researches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time, but look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. <laughs> Love, hope, compassion. This is what people say monster souls are made of. But the absolute nature of soul is unknown. After all, humans have proven their souls don't need these things to exist. Oh, damn. Here I am, writing this book. A person comes in and picks up a book. They start reading it. Oh, sorry. I'm still writing that one. <laughs> because they are made of magic, monsters' body are attuned to their soul. If a monster doesn't want to fight, its defenses will weaken. And the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more their attacks will hurt us. 
Therefore, if being with a powerful soul struck with the desire to kill. Um, let's add a chapter here. <laughs> well, monsters are mostly made of magic. Human beings are mostly made of water. Humans, with their physical form, are far stronger than us. But they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. They'll never get a bullet pattern birthday card. <laughs> Alright guys, well, let's go save again because for today I don't really have a lot of time. So I'm gonna save it here, this is a short episode but I hope you guys enjoyed this. My name is Jack Madness and have a great mad day.